Look, we all know the Giants are done at 0-4. They're not going to go to the playoffs this year. This season is lost. That being said, they're kind of in a, stuck in a weird limbo spot for the time being before we get later in the season and we can truly assess, is this team just going to kind of bottom out and be a three-win team that competes for a top five, top three pick? Or are they going to be a team that kind of hovers around 500 the rest of the way, wins a couple of games? That's still to be determined, and we're not going to know that for the next couple of weeks, probably until Thanksgiving before we know which kind of fork in the road and which side this team's going to take. In the time being, though, the Giants have to start stressing getting the young players on their roster who they know are going to be part of their future in 2018 and beyond. they got to start getting those guys playing time, and it should start this week against the Chargers at home with running back Wayne Gallman. Strong rookie debut in the loss of the Bucks on Sunday. He's got to be the starting running back going forward. I know 42 yards, 11 carries, 3.8 yards per carry. That's not terribly impressive, but look, this Giants run game is one of the worst in the NFL. That's pretty good what they've had, and it's unfortunate for a guy like Paul Perkins, who just has had multiple opportunities this season, hasn't produced. Orleans Darkwell, it seemed like he was pushing to get that starting job. He gets hurt, you know, kind of the story of his career so far. Look, I think Goldman has to be the guy. Chargers have one of the worst rush defenses in the NFL. This is an opportunity for the Giants to try to get something going as they strive towards that first win on Sunday at home. Uh, look, it's Goldman's time. I think that, you know, he was up and down in the, in the preseason. He's been inactive for the first three games, but he showed the Giants something on Sunday. He made a way to make some things happen, had a touchdown catch. It's time for the Giants to move on from Paul Perkins, who in hindsight, they probably should not have been so quick to declare as the starter back in May when Ben McAdoo infamously said he was going to be the starter on Mike Francesa's radio program following the NFL draft. It's time to go to Wayne Gallman as the starting running back. It was clear from the Bucks game he gives the Giants the best chance to have some sort of run game. It's time to go with Gallman, and going forward, it's time to look at other young players and get them on the field. Giants aren't going anywhere. They need to start looking towards the future, and they can build and get something out of this season, salvage it by playing their young players. It should start Sunday with Wayne Gallman.